Welcome back, Peer Structure Traders and YouTube for another market analysis for the London session. Today we'll be going over S&P 500 gold and also oil, give you guys some of the levels we'll be looking at. So again, if you guys do like the videos, please go ahead and smash that like button. If you are not subscribed to the channel yet, please go ahead and subscribe. Uh, again, if you guys have any questions, feel free to pop them in here on YouTube. We'd love to get back to you guys. Make sure you guys check out the morning market analysis videos as well, which is an hour before the U.S. session open for you guys to get some levels and also the tutorial videos. Uh, again, I'll probably be doing a double top video for you guys pretty soon. So I've just been a little bit hectic on my end, but uh, everybody over here is getting back to good health. So uh, pretty good on our end. But with that said, guys, let's go ahead and jump into it, show you guys exactly what we'll be looking at for the London session. So for S&P 500, uh, if we scroll out, you can see we've had a lot, a lot of downward movement support going all the way down into these 4212s. Had a really, really strong uh, bearish day today, could, so could have caught a lot of good opportunity to do that. Uh, to the downside, then you see the market shooting right back up. Probably has a lot of, well, you can see a lot of fear going on in that market, uh, but definitely strong downward day. So for London session, want to see if we catch some of the supports and try to move it right back up into those 4500s. But right now, you can see overhead resistance, a couple levels right around these uh, 4407 to so about 1075, strong resistance up above. You can see the market broke one of our main areas, which is these 437450s, and we could potentially be heading down. Our support underneath is 4342.50 and 4337.50. So want to see S&P 500 get here first and then then from here get the opportunity to bounce back up so we're keeping that in mind that's going to be the area of interest for us uh, maybe to get a nice long if we get a double bottom here for those who want to try to catch this movement down you could get it to come back into the resistance now if we fail these uh, 7450s again this may be a nice sell the rip opportunity to try to rip lower and then continue that move to the downside but for us probably gonna well for me I'm probably gonna be looking for a long opportunity if we get a double bottom here at these uh, 3750s if not next level down below 2225 and then below that 7675 want to see a nice double bottom here to get a nice move to the upside from there so we'll keep that in mind but again for the shorts want to get it right around 7450 if not we could be moving right back into these 07 to about 1075s that's going to be where we could see some strong resistance as well so just keep that in mind as we draw into the london session moving over into gold Gold coming up against a wall of resistance, strong 1843.7 to about 1843. We have had resistance pretty much all day at that area. Nice double top that we saw happening right off the uh, open, well, a little bit before the open that pushed us right back down into support. So want to see if we get a nice rejection off that area again. And if we fail to go through 43.7, that's going to be a nice double top again to bring us right back down into our supports 1836.3 then 1833.6 those are the main support areas down below a pretty strong one 1829.7 you can see we've touched that one two and three times and continue to bounce right back up from that level so if we get there again that's going to be where we're looking for a long opportunity as well uh, but before that 33.6 and 38 well, I'm sorry, 36.3 as the area of support above. So keep those in mind. Resistance above these 43s, 1847.7 is going to be what we're looking at on gold. Moving over into crude oil, let's take a look. Crude oil, kind of similar scenario to S&P. You can see we're trying to head right back up. But wall of resistance for us, 8406 to about 8414. That's where we're looking for this resistance here had a nice double top off that to bring us right back down want to see if we get this to pull down deeper our support is 8324 underneath could get a nice bounce from that area if not you could see a deeper dive you can see we bounced off it one time here these 8266s so getting down into that level could give us a nice open wider double bottom here that could push us right back up so just keep that in mind if we get there and it exhausts and it bounces from there you could look for a nice long opportunity to get back up. Now, for those who want this short and try to see, continue the short, uh, well, the short side to the downside that uh, push lower, you could try to get it right off these uh, 84.6s. Resistance above that 84.85 and then 85.45 as the resistance 
above so we'll keep that in mind as we draw into the london session as well but that wraps it up for s p 500 gold and also oil make sure if you guys are not subscribed to the videos and the channel please go ahead and subscribe if you guys do like these videos please go ahead and smash that like button if you're um or if you have any questions feel free to pop them in here on youtube we'd love to get back to you guys other than that if you guys continue to trade make sure you guys trade well you guys have a great night take care